vibe, but now let's talk about this. This is the pulse, and this really does help um, to create in your own home the technique of a hairdresser or a hairstylist when they are trying to create the most volume for you right at the crown. So all of our volume gals out there, you're gonna wanna listen up as Ryan and Janessa tell us about this. So talk to us about Pulse and how I can use this. I mean, like, where do I put this? <laughs> <laughs> so you're just gonna take your elbow and you're just gonna slide it. <laughs> Perfect. So Perfect, I figured that. <laughs> so, it's, it's great. It's going to take your hair dryer that you have at home and just pump it up. It's going to supercharge it. So you're going to take the pulse. It's going to slide it right on to the nozzle of your blow dryer just like that. And now we're going to have controlled air coming out. So it's not just because I know for a fact everybody at home does not use the concentrator on their blow dryer. They usually open the box and they're like, what is this thing? And then they kind of just throw it out and don't worry about mm -hmm. it. And they end up blow drying their hair with an open end of the blow dryer against the round brush like that. Well, that's not doing anything to your hair. It's not smoothing it and it's not controlling the air at all. So this way, you're gonna put the pulse on, just like this. Perfect. And not only is it controlling the air, but it's a cyclone air that's coming out. It's almost like a tornado. <gasps> so when I go through her hair, it's gonna help with volume and it's gonna help with controlled air. So it's not just gonna shoot the hair all over the place, it's gonna control it and keep it on your brush and give it more of a smoother look with more volume and um, I was gonna say one more thing to you guys. I have a oh, question. Oh, go oh, ahead. No, I was just gonna say uh, with, you know what, come back to me and you ask me your question. Well, okay. let's see it Let's see it in action. I was gonna ask if you could point the hair dryer towards the camera so we could see oh, what yeah, that sure. looks like. Yeah, sure. Yeah. And you can see the so spinning action So do I have to worry right about there. that getting stuck and in I'll, my hair no, at all? No, your hair okay. will not get stuck in this because the air is blowing out. It's not gonna suck it in at all, but you can see right there. Now I have it on low air right there. And see how it's spinning? Yeah. And it's charging, it's actually boosting the ions that, that are coming from your blow dryer oh. out into your hair as well. So it's kind of like adding real estate, yes, really. Yes, yes. So I'm gonna put this on, I'm gonna show you with Christy's hair. <laughs> it's gonna go into it just like this. Now I like to over direct, and it's gonna kind of show a couple techniques everybody at home. Because I know when you're at home and I know you blow dry your hair, you usually take sections and you're looking in the mirror and you're pulling down like this. Well, not only are you just getting more curl on the bottom, but you're pulling, you're pulling the hair up top here. So any kind of heat that you put on this head is straightening out. And then when you drop your hair, you have no volume up top. So make sure when you blow dry your hair, you're going up and out and over direct. Always over direct on top because so that's how you're going to get. Show us, Ryan, how okay. to over direct the hair. I'm going to um, say. Because this is something turn. that, again, wow. many women, when they're, you know, blow drying their hair at home, they don't know some of these, uh, you know, kind of little techniques that okay. really help them get that volume that's going to last all day long. Well, Rebecca on Facebook is already like, oh my God, I need this. So. Yeah. <laughs> so you see how I'm going forward just like that? That's over directing the hair. So as you pull that, you just want to take this and this is what's going to create that volume. See how, see how it's pulsating the hair right there? I don't know if you can see that right there. So it's like pulsing the hair right there. And it's not just blowing the hair in any kind of direction. It's controlled air that I'm putting onto the hair right there. So as I do that, and I over direct and get that heat underneath, I want to heat that up and then I'm going to do a cool shot just like this on top. And I want to cool the heat that's on there. I love how ergonomic that is. Like you're sitting that on the top of her head and yet it's still comfortable. <laughs> like with your other hair dryer, that would not, you would have already been like, uncle, yeah, right? that's hot. <laughs> um, Ryan, what's the difference between this and a concentrator? So a concentrator is great because I love using the concentrator just for, well, my purposes only. I, I like it because it does control the air, but it doesn't have a, a control, see what's great about this is for you at home, and I know a lot of you, if you were to use the concentrator, it's a lot harder for you to control your hair because it's, it's hard to balance a round brush and blow dryer. Mm -hmm. That's why we made the pulse because we want it to be easier for you to get the similar concept of a concentrator, concentrating that air just on your brush and not blowing it everywhere else, but now it's gonna be simpler, simpler for you to do 
and have controlled air that way with that with that cyclone air that's coming out of the with the dryer so now if you're wondering at home if this attachment is heavy um, I would say it's it's not any heavier than any kind of diffuser attachment or I think that's a um, totally appropriate yeah, weight kind of tip that I've ever seen and I just want to show you if we can get like a nice close up look this is what's pulsating the air on the inside there's this little kind of almost like fan propeller mm -hmm. and it helps the air kind of move around and that pulsating action of the airflow gives you more volume at the root when and you're over directing. And I will say like when you are over directing, what's cool about this concept, whether that concentrator would be flat, mm -hmm. sometimes I feel like when you get the round brush in, it kind of like falls out because it's like too much air in a specific area and then other parts of your hair get frizzy. Since this is cylindrical, I like that it's probably a more yeah. even distribution of concentrated air yeah. versus that flat line that's so hard to control. And then let's just show you this side as well because here um, there is like this um, almost like a giant rubber band on the outside here yeah. that allows this to stretch and fit it's like an elasticized waistband yes <laughs> something that i would need <laughs> um, something that i wear daily <laughs> that's right um and this works on pretty much almost any hair dryer i believe it would yes the only air right dryers the that it, it doesn't really work on are the really stubby ones mm -hmm. okay you need to find the store or it should work on every hotel blow dryer okay. but some still use those little tiny ones which it probably would not fit on as well but 90% of blow dryers, the pulse will fit on. Ryan, can I only use this with a round brush? Can I use this with a paddle brush or can I use this to air dry my hair? You can use hair? it even with your hand if you like. If you want to go in just with your hand and just create some volume. Next day hair, if you just want to yeah. pump it up again yeah. and you just want to kind of go in, I'll show you right now. I'm going to go in, I'm just going to, just using that pulse, controlled air. It's not blowing the hair all crazy everywhere, but I'm going to get that maximum lift. But look at that. See what I'm getting on the side of her hair right there? See the volume that wow. I'm getting on the side? I and love that's that you just didn't have to my hand. the hair to yeah. get that way. You know, like getting that kind of volume. Like yeah. that's the kind in the south that we would have been like, all right, hold your breath. Yeah. It's going to be painful, but get, it's going to be worth it. Get me back home. <laughs> get me back home. <laughs> um, well, you know what's really cool is that they actually did clinical tests on this, and it increased hair volume by over 104% when they yes. used I'm sorry, hair volume. Uh, yeah. 104%. I mean, it's like 100% better than right now. It's like now. double. <laughs> it's like a daily double. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> if I'm understanding you correctly. That's right. And so, I mean, look at all the additional volume that Ryan is able to create with Christie's hair. Um, and really, at the same time, you know, you're not using. Uh, High heat, or are you, or, or and high pressure with the airflow? I am on high heat right now. Okay. And I'm on, um, I'm on actually on the low fan setting. Okay. Okay. And it's still working as good as it's working. Now, what would you normally do if you didn't have a microphone attached to your shirt? <laughs> would uh, you do it like uh, with high fan setting as well? Yeah, I would. I mean, okay. you know, it, it's just easier for me to hear you guys. Yeah. I'm over out here, but I would definitely use a high fan, high heat setting to get that maximum lift and volume with the, with the pulse. But this is just as great because I'm, I'm really working her hair right now. We're, you, we're doing a almost the day after look with Christy's hair because mm -hmm. she did have beautiful, beautiful hair yesterday. And we're just, I wanted her to come in and we just want to have her hair because, you know, if you sleep on it, it gets flat, obviously. But going back in with the pulse on dry hair and we're just going to recreate that look that she had early on or yesterday, and she just had more volume, more lift, and she does have like a real, you know, beautiful wave that's in their hair right now. And it's great too, you know, it doesn't, like I was saying, it controls the air, it controls Would the Would you heat. say that it helps you dry your hair a little more efficiently because you have better distribution yes. of air? Of course, of course. See, that, that to me is what I find very, very interesting with this, especially because you can use it with a, a paddle brush, a round brush, you can even air dry it with your hands. To me, I think that a lot of times there's great technology in hair dryers, but you miss the distribution for long hair, short hair, curly hair, or maybe you're not the professional at home that knows how to give that professional style blowout. I think that this is attachment literally for less than $40 is worth improving the equity in the dryer that you have home, but also the ease of use with how you choose to style your hair all throughout the day. And if you're interested, don't forget to take a look at that item number. It's at the top left uh, part of your screen. That's where you'll go to beautyiq.com and enter in that information, or you can call our 1-800 number. But this is your time that, you know what, if you've been wanting to kind of 
prolong the life of your dryer or maybe you've wanted to educate yourself on how to have more practical styles, mm -hmm. what a great accessory to add to something that yeah. You know, you really shouldn't be replacing all that often. You know what? It's almost like when you buy your cell phone and then you go and you buy a case for it. Exactly. And then you buy the additional light for it or wow. anything like that. Um, I mean, this is just going to up the ante on any hair dryer that you already have at home. You don't have to go and spend hundreds of dollars of an investment no. on a brand new hair dryer. You can just turbo boost it with the Callista Pulse um, dryer attachment. And remember, guys, it's less than 40 bucks. You can try it out for 30 days, see the difference in your own house. But you know, when I hear clinical results, 104% increase in volume um, versus drying with your hair dryer alone, mm -hmm. uh, that's really fabulous. And remember, it's all with this wonderful kind of spindle uh, propeller technology on the inside here. That's what's spinning around and giving you that pulse action that gives you more volume at the root without having to tease. Well, on Facebook, Tina says her hair has a lot of volume already and Ryan isn't even done yet. Nice. Well, we're going to show you her before and after just so you can see how she started just in case you're just tuning in. And you know, you're right. She does have an incredible head of hair. Yes. But now. Va, 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 va. And see how quick we got all of that volume? We just went back and to her hair, you could see right there, and just pumped it up. And you, you didn't have to put any product in there. And we didn't put any product in at all. And I would love to spend a little bit more time with her to kind of define those curls, which you could also do with that. But just to show you guys how quick I got that volume just from over directing and showing you how to do it. And I'll show you the back real quick. All right, so there's the before. <gasps> and see how oh her layers kind of came goodness. alive too as well. Mm -hmm. I didn't even wow. see she had layers in the before. It's Isn't gorgeous. That great? And, and I love the fact that the volume is completely throughout, not just at the top, uh -huh. not just at the bottom. You're getting this wonderful even layer of volume. Now, Ryan, you're spraying something in her hair. What is that that you're spraying? I'm spraying the Shine Max. I love Ooh. this stuff because if you feel like your hair has just become a little bit more dull, or you're color treated and it's become a little bit more dull, just spray a little bit of Shine Max on it and it really just makes that color come back to life. Especially for blondes, yeah. like to yes. be able to get that kind of shine mm -hmm. when you talked about processed hair. You know, it's easy when you're natural and brunette yeah. like us out there. Uh, yeah, too. exactly. <laughs> <laughs> well, that is available at beautyiq.com as well. If you just type in Shine Mist, you'll be able to find it there. Um, but remember guys, the pulse is going to work with any hair dryer that you have at home, almost any hair dryer that you have at home, as long yeah. as it has a little bit of a nozzle um, that sticks out. And you're getting it home for less than 40 bucks. So try it out, see what it's all about. Use that item number on your screen at beautyiq.com or call this number and ask for one of our customer service reps. Now, um, we are gonna take a very short break. Very short break. Very short. But Blink we, and you'll miss us. Yes, <laughs> but when we come back, we are going to get that red carpet.